A mason wants to be sure she has a right corner in a building's foundation. She marks a point three feet from the corner along one wall and another point four feet from the corner along the other wall. If the corner is a right angle, what should the distance be between the two marked points? You can see that this forms a right triangle with one leg three feet, one leg four feet, and a hypotenuse of x feet. We'll begin by familiarizing ourselves with the situation. In this case, we have been given a sketch of a right triangle, and we know one leg is three, one leg is four, and we are trying to find the distance x. Since we have a right triangle, we can translate using the Pythagorean theorem. We have three squared plus four squared equals x squared. Now we can move to the third step, which is to carry out. In this case, we want to solve for x. We have three squared, which is nine, four squared, which is 16. That equals x squared. Nine plus 16 is 25. Now this is a quadratic equation. So let's get zero on one side of the equation and solve. Subtracting 25 from both sides, we have zero equals x squared minus 25. And then we can factor. Zero equals x plus five times x minus five. Setting each of these equal to zero, we have x plus five equals zero, or x minus five equals zero. And this tells us then that x equals negative five, or x equals five. Now, since we're talking about a real problem with distances, we're not going to use the negative number. We're going to check our answer 5. If the distance, the hypotenuse, is 5 feet, then we would have 3 squared plus 4 squared, and we check to see, does that equal 5 squared? Well, we have 9 plus 16, and that does equal 25, so our answer checks. So we say and state as the last step, the distance is five feet.